hello guys welcome to another video tutorial in this video i'm gonna teach with you how you can make a registration form using html and css3 so this is our simple image and also background image and this is uh, basically those are input text field and this is a simple button and this is a link i'll teach with you how you can create this type of registration form do you want to increase the uh, input text field you can do that in my case I just use three input text fields so I go to my code editor inside my code editor have a uh, two images like background.jpg and user.png you can find those images from pixabay.com I'm gonna show with you first uh, write the pixabay.com and write the simple user once you set the user then you are able to see this is an image i have edited this image on Adobe photoshop and also you can get this same background image from pixabay.com i'm gonna use paris and i'm gonna get the name Pi. right and paris right Okay, and uh, I'm gonna get the name of the Paris like this one. Okay, what is the name of the Eiffel Tower? Copy that and go to pixabay.com, paste here, and then you will be able to see the same image like this one, right? I have used this image on background, right? You can uh, copy the uh, I mean, download the image and uh, use in the background, right? So, I'm going to close that and well, let's write the basic syntax of HTML. I'm going to open this one in the live server, right? And close that, and I'm going to write the basic syntax of HTML. So, first thing, write the HTML and use um, a registration um, using HTML5 and CSS3 right and I'm gonna link that style sheet uh, like style.css and then I'm gonna use the class sign up form then I'm gonna get the image from my folder the image will be used to display the logo like uh, user.png then I'm gonna use a uh, form action is a uh, index.html method is post Do you want to use that you can do that in my case I use for PHP purpose right but this time I just use that to design the registration form type uh, and then I'm gonna use placeholder just a minute I'm gonna use placeholder I use a username class txt copy that paste paste two times right and I'm gonna change the type like email third one is a password and I'm gonna also change the input text uh, field placeholder like email and then uh, third one is a password this is a placeholder finally I'm gonna use input text field type button value create account class sign up uh, I'm gonna use PTN just in the so let's look at that on the browser okay this is our image and this is our simple form okay don't worry I will use a CSS properties to design that okay so first thing we need to use body I'm gonna use margin zero pixel padding zero pixel background I'm gonna use uh, leave the background right basically I will upload at uh, the background image here in parentheses and I will use background image right no repeat and background size cover 
right so and let's check it now in the browser right this is our image okay so the next thing we need to target the sign up form class and then we need to use with 300 pixel padding 20 pixel text align center background RGBA 101102114 and this is opacity okay 0 0.7 this is opacity and those are basic color combination code right and then I'm gonna use position absolute and top 50% left 50% I'm gonna use transform to display the complete uh, form on the center we use translate negative 50% comma negative 50% and I'm gonna use our fellow hidden and border radius 0 0.5 pixel right save that and let's check it now okay then we need to go on code editor and let's work on the sign up form input and display block with 100% and padding left 10 pixel height 44 pixel and then uh, but I also target the image guys just a minute I target sign up from IMG uh, with 50% and then we need to use a uh, comma and height 50% right this is our image right then I'm gonna target the form and protect will right first save that and let's check it now right this is our image looks like great okay then I'm gonna target the sign up form and protect field right and I'm gonna use border box sizing border box outline none border none and I'm gonna get the font from um, Google Fonts. Uh, I mean Google Fonts. So I'm gonna call it Google Fonts and use that. And I'm gonna select the Google Font like uh, there is a one to this one. Click to add now and copy this link. Go to your index.html file, paste it right, and then you need to just. Uh, copy that and go to style.css and paste it right and I'm gonna use font size 40 pixel right then I'm gonna target the txt class that will include inside our input text field right inside that I'm gonna use margin 20 pixel and also 0 pixel border radius 0 0.5 pixel first set that and let's check it now Close that as you can see guys right now the next thing we need to target the link oh, sorry button I'm gonna call btn and margin top 60 pixel margin bottom uh, 20 pixel and let's background hash 47 EB zero and color is a white uh, 
border radius 40 pixel cursor pointer right and uh, I'm gonna use also transition 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 0 0.8 uh, second right then I'm gonna target the button and you want to use a hover the mouse then I'm gonna use transform scale transform scale uh, 0 0.96 so well, let's check it now as you can see guys right now the next thing is a link so first thing we need to create a link and already have a account right and then I'm going to target that this link on here so I'm going to call dot sign up form anchor link first remove the de text decoration null color is as uh, black I'm going to use black and font family I'm going to use font family I'm going to use font family same okay this one copy that and paste here and padding 10 pixel transition 0 0.8 second display block and finally we need to target the sign up form anchor link hover the mouse I'm gonna change the background color just uh, background and also text I'm gonna use RGBI 0 comma 0 comma 0 comma 0 0.3 color is white Set that and let's check it now mm, I think something is wrong sign sign up form copy it and let's check it now uh, what is problem now sign oh form anchor link sign okay there's a mistake guys form as you can see guys so this is a very simple form I have I used HTML and CSS3 to design that you can use that to design any type of registration file I just use uh, I just want to show you how you can design that so thank you very much for watching see you in the next lecture or next video please subscribe my channel for getting updates have a nice day guys